Hey guys, today we will animate the sky. For this we will need a background, I used episode original one, and the cloud overlay. Open the background in Photoshop, select it with Ctrl plus A and copy it with Ctrl plus C. Create a new file with transparent background and paste the image using Ctrl plus V. Now we need to trace the sky with polygonal lasso tool. As soon as the sky is selected, we need to erase it with the delete key. Save this image in PNG format and upload it in the art gallery as an overlay. Open the script, add the background and the overlay we created along with it. It should be on layer Let's make it 5, as we will put several other overlays underneath it. Now we need to add a cloud overlay. We'll put it with random coordinates for now. Put it on layer 0. Let's find our cloud, scale it and put it in the right position. Shift it off screen left and change the coordinates in the script. Now we are going to animate it with a looping command. Start with an ampersand, then shift the cloud off screen right, write down the coordinate. Don't forget to put in zone 1, so it won't shift in any other zone by accident. And let's make it move in 20 seconds. Next, our cloud will shift right back to off-screen left position in 0 seconds. Afterwards, put loop infinite times. Use the coordinates from here. Let's copy the cloud overlay and create another one, so it will look more cloudy. We'll name it Cloud01. Move it to layer 1 and make it visible through changing its opacity. Shift it and scale it and do all the steps as we did for the first cloud. We'll make this cloud move faster than the first one. It will shift in 15 seconds. You can change the time to be whatever you like. Here we have it, our sky is animated, but we can do one more thing, we can make the clouds reflect in the water. Open the overlay we created previously and trace the water with polygonal lasso tool. 
You can make a step back by pressing Backspace. Once you are done, right click on it and pick layer via cut. Now we need to change the opacity of this layer to 70%. Save it in PNG format and upload it instead of the old one. Create a third cloud with overlay cloud 03, create from cloud 02, move it to layer 0, make it visible and give it the same scale as the cloud 01, but this time make the number negative so the cloud will turn upside down. Set the third cloud in the right position. It will move simultaneously with the other cloud, the bigger one. Write down the coordinates. Now let's make a looping comment. All steps are the same. By the way, if you've noticed, I changed the number of seconds from 15 and 20 to 20 and 25, so the cloud movement would seem more natural. We've done a wonderful job. I hope you enjoyed animating the sky with me. As always, you can find this template and overlays in my coding school along with the text tutorial. Thanks for your attention and I will see you in the next video tutorial.